Climate change has been very successfully uh, pigeonholed as being yet another issue on which scientists and people of faith disagree. But on issues like evolution and the age of the universe, there's reasons in a literal reading of the Bible why people would not agree with what the science says. So you could actually have a passage in the Bible that says one thing and a scientist says another thing. But with climate change, there's no such passage. In fact, there's passages saying, you know, God will destroy those who destroy the earth. And there's other passages talking about how humans are given responsibility to care for every little thing created on the face of the earth. So climate change has been falsely framed as an issue between faith and science. If anything, people of faith should be on the front lines of trying to address this issue rather than dragging behind. There's a really good basis to connect on values that we share and talk about creation in nature and science. So for example, if I'm talking to um, a conservative Christian college or a group of people who I know are a little doubtful on the science and maybe are a little worried about having a scientist come and talk to them, I think reminding people that the world around us and the universe around us is what Paul calls a revelation of God to us. It's almost like God's second book to us. So in understanding the way that the universe is put together and the way that our earth works and the incredible balance that our earth has that we are disrupting through our carbon emissions, we're understanding what God was thinking when he set it up in the first place.